Hello guys and welcome back to another episode of Cindy's Home Kitchen. Happy New Year to all Happy New from Year, my everybody. heart to you guys. I never did, but now hey, Happy New Year. Everybody's different. And uh, today, this morning, actually not this morning, it's one o'clock in the afternoon. And of course I went back to uh, Waterburger. And what I got was, oh, yeah. is it, oh here's my barbecue sauce, Michael. So this is what I got. I got me a medium fry, which mm. I love these fries. Hey, I got from a medium water fry too. And mm. I got the little chicken nuggets. Mm. I think they gave me three, four, five, six of them. I and guess what I got? A piece of toast. Our barbecue sauce that I have right here. And I also... Uh, got a water burger iced tea. And how much was it? Michael paid for it. And I got a bacon. You know, I don't have a, a job. A bacon so cheeseburger. Here. Well, my job in my kitchen. But here we go. It was 16 almost $17. But that's not bad. So here we are again, oh. guys. I'm sorry, guys. I have not made any videos. But I was kind of like a crazy week. You know? Oh, I had it the wrong way. My daughter, like I told you guys, my daughter Jennifer didn't come for the holidays she always comes but for some reason this year she decided not to come so oh what did michael got michael got uh, bacon cheeseburger you got tomatoes you got your meat you got some pickles oh, yeah. you got some bacon and that's a lettuce here michael <laughs> eat that lettuce eh, there you go there you go mm. i don't actually don't eat, you know so yeah I, so that's about it i think i'm gonna eat it with tomato today so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna start eating guys some of my uh, chicken nuggets. Let me eat another couple of more fries. These are so good. Mm. Mm. So anyway, mm. I'm gonna tell you guys. Mm. Hey, what I've been thinking about doing this year. The last time I spoke to you guys, I was talking about mm. medical insurance and all that, and how mm. expensive it is. And even if we have the money to buy the insurance, just the deductible, I mean, you can, I, we can't afford it. It's just like way too much. So I'm trying to push my channel because I want to be able to uh, to buy my own insurance with my own channel. That's right. You know, I'm making my videos and what's on And um, I bought some food for the holidays to mm -hmm. cook. But I forgot to tell you guys because the last time I spoke to you guys was right before Christmas or a day or two before Christmas, right? Even the, the last tomatoes that are we good. Made. Yeah, they're good. I never tried tomatoes so, like that. Huh? I never tried tomatoes like that. I was going to make videos about my stove at the house. It broke down. That's right. Um, so I had yesterday on New Year's Day, uh, we had the electric company come to the house. Let me talk, Michael. Don't interrupt me. Twice uh, to see what was going on because we have partial electricity. We have some electricity in some of the rooms, but then the rest of the house, there was no electricity. So uh, they left, they fixed it, whatever. I woke up, the boys told me, oh, mom, they came in, they fixed this, whatever. So I got up and I'm like, okay, so I, I went and made some biscuits, some bacon, and I'm like, okay, I'm going to have some food to cook for later so we can make some videos. And um, so happens that right after I made the breakfast, oh, again, the electric went out. And then we noticed that uh, by pushing the buttons on the stove, like to uh, high, low, the electric was on, off. So we called the electric company again. They came back and they said, Don't try not to use the stove. So we did call the office in the front, which I'm going to turn. Um, we're just sitting in the parking lot of mm -hmm. the development where I live. We told them. I haven't heard anything from them. I called them this morning again. So I'm sitting in front of the office because when I'm done with the video, I'm going to go and I'm going to tell them because... I need a stove. I mean, how what am I supposed to do? I have my coffee pot and I have my microwave and then I have my air fryer, oh, yeah. my sandwich maker, you know. But I can't cook anything. So, so here I am. I was gonna make some um, mm. some pork that I was gonna make, but I caught him because now the stuff is not working, so here we are doing this. So I'm gonna eat my first chicken nugget, guys. Here we go. Mm -hmm. From Water Burger. Did I have had these from Water Burger before? I don't think I have. Mm -mm. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. But you haven't had that, right? No, I haven't had this bacon cheeseburger. I haven't good. But when I had it, I didn't eat this with um with this chicken nuggets. I mean, with uh, the barbecue sauce. I think it was with ketchup, right? That I was dipping it in. Yeah. So anyway, guys, that's the story. And uh. 
Okay, like I said, when I'm done, I'm going to go in and tell them, but it's just kind of like, I'm not going to say aggravating, but aggravating. it's hard not being with a stove, you know? Yesterday, I made some hot dogs, and because um, we have like a little oven, an electric oven also, and I put some hot dogs in there, heated up the bread, fed my husband that, and then I went myself to McDonald's and had like four burgers. And then I came back home. I mean, you know, but what are you going to do, right? I have so like anyways, six burgers. Yeah. So, anyways. Mm. Mm, Speaking I of burgers. Know what you mm? This is the best burger I think I've had. Mm hmm. They're good, right? From Whataburger, yeah. Mm hmm. Bacon cheeseburger, everybody. I wish I could have the tomato. The number five. But we don't. How much know? was it? I don't know. You really want that paint, like Florentine? Sixteen sixty nine. Mm. I don't mm. know. I just, I just want to like uh, be able to uh, make enough money to support myself, so I don't have to depend on anybody or anything. That's you know? right. I just want to be able to support myself and be able to go see my parents whenever I want to. That's right. And if I want to send them, uh, 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 um. Whatever they need, I should be able to, and I feel kind of like uh, I have my hands tied, and um, because I don't feel that good, if I would have like have, um, you know, like not being pink, that's the whole thing about having problems with the stomach. You think you're fine, and you might look good on the outside, but I always have a headache. My stomach always hurts. My pelvis always hurts. My abdomen is always in pain. That's right. It doesn't matter what I do. Sometimes when I'm sleeping at night. My stomach hurts while I'm sleeping and I'm conscious and I can feel the pain while I'm sleeping. I mean, it's like there all the time, you know, and I don't know what to do. And then there's a lot of food that I can't eat. And maybe if I would have been like on a treatment, I should be able to tolerate certain things. You know what I'm saying? Or with a, with a the adequate treatment, I can get better. So, but I can't do that because I don't have any insurance. Right. Okay. And... The fact that I don't have any insurance, that stresses me out to a level where the stress plays a role in, um, with my colitis, the stress itself plays a role with it, and it all comes up together, you know what I'm saying? I'm a full-blown menopausal, and I have colitis, and anxiety, and um, just not being able to do the things that I need to get done, you know what I'm saying? Puts me in a situation where I don't know if the anxiety makes it worse, but somehow, emotionally, I think it does. So, the good thing that I have is you guys, the channel, because I like the cooking. I want to make some meals. I want to make some uh, recipes. So, anyway, you guys, yeah, that. So, mm, this is so good. Mm -hmm. I'm so hungry, though. Mm, me too. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Mm. This is very, very delicious. Are you having ketchup? Oh, yeah. You what? That's right. Mm. Mm -hmm. They go like that, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. This is good. We gotta make more videos, Mike. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Eventually, guys, I wanna do uh, YouTube full time. Let's go to um, Taco Bell. Okay. We haven't been in Taco Bell. No. I can find something that I can have there. I know I can. But most of it's corn and ground beef. But not everything is corn. Mostly. Yeah? Maybe flour but tortillas? Flour tortillas? But what? I can have flour tortillas. Flour tortillas. Okay, but so I we'll can have in. beans. The flour tortillas, they usually, uh, you know what I mean? Oh, I can have tacos and flour tortillas. You can. Right? Soft tacos. Yeah, soft tacos. Soft tacos. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, with no cheese and no lettuce. No beans. Mm -hmm. No beans. Because the meat doesn't have beans. Mm -hmm. They add it in. So I know we can look at the menu. That's our next video, guys. Taco Bell. I know we can look at the menu. You heard it here. And I can find, can I have a ketchup, please? Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Spicy mm -mm. ketchup. I don't want no spicy ketchup. We have a bag full of ketchup. This lady gave us a bunch of spicy ketchup. Yeah. What gives? Oh, wait, wait, wait. She didn't understand what we were saying. I know, I asked. Didn't you see? I know, I said, barbecue sauce, please. And she said, oh, okay. And she closed the window. Mm -hmm. And she didn't give me my barbecue sauce. 
She didn't understand that she didn't speak a, a gram of English. No. Not even an ounce. I mean, I'm in barbecue. But whatever. You know, it is what it is. Mm-mm. Still have fries? Couple left. I I just don't wanna get sick. I'm still hungry. No, very hungry. Yep. Now what I wanna eat like a big bowl of rice. Are we gonna go in and talk to these people? And pepper steak. What if they went to my house? How am I gonna go talk to them? What if they went to the house while we were gone? So let's go home. You can call them on the phone and then you can talk to them. I'm gonna call them from here, from my phone. Okay. Before I go. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Starving. I'm gonna tell uh, Jimmy to hold the rent, not pay them. Because it's the second, and yesterday was New Year's Day, guys, and I went with no stove. I couldn't cook no food for my family, no desserts, no, you know what I'm saying, snacks and hors d'oeuvres, nothing. I could make nothing for my family, and because my stove in the office was closed, you know? But the first thing they should have done, because an emergency, was be there, check my outlet, because there's a shore in it, fix it, and bring me a new stove. That's how we're asking. They don't have any problem trying to charge you late fees when you don't pay your rent on time. That's right. I don't think that you have a problem coming and bringing me a stove when I need it. You know? No problem at all. But no, they don't even pick up the phone. It's the first day after New Year's. Actually, I called them yesterday. They didn't even pick up the phone. And I know they were there. They just don't pick it up. You know? And they don't like me because when I come in, I'm, you know, one of these days I'm going to have Michael record. But I think you get scared, Michael, don't you? Yeah, I'm going to have Michael record and you'll see. Because I always put him in their place. You know what? Them. So I'm going to tell you something. I wasn't born with hair on my tongue. That's right. God gave me some vocal cords and a tongue to speak my mind. And we live in a world right now where every get everybody gets offended every time you say something. Like you're saying something wrong. You know you're right. They know that you know that you're right. All this stuff that's going and on right now. And they still want to come and try to flip it. Like, don't look at me like that, dude. You should be able to say whatever you want as long as it doesn't hurt anybody. If I'm paying you rent and my stove breaks, which is an emergency, okay? You should come and fix my, my uh, stove right away and fix it. That's right. Right away. That's right. It shouldn't take time. They have uh, warehouses right here in the development where they, they store the stoves, the microwaves, and everything that they have. Huh? I look like a ghost. And I know this because the workers that come and fix our stuff, they're always talking blabbing stuff about this place. And I'm not saying that the place is bad, but they have really bad. You call them and they come whenever they want. You know what I'm saying? And then what bothers me is if they want to pull that, then I should be able to hold the rent until they bring me a stove, right? That's right. But that ain't going to play out. Mm -hmm. I have brain freeze. Oh, my eye. My eye. I have brain freeze. Leave me a little bit. For you? These are so, so good. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. You can't have this. Mm. Mm -hmm. <sighs> mm. Yeah, right there like that, man. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have some good chicken nuggets. Or chicken fillets. I think I just saw one of them pass by. Hmm? Mike! Why are you doing that? Here. What's that? Have a nugget. That's the last one. One nugget for me? Yeah, here. But that's you your nugget. No, you're gonna, here's the barbecue. Why do they call these nuggets? Oh, I don't know. It's a chicken. Because they're round. That's what it is, right, people? Because they're round like that. That's why they call them nuggets. Mm. So anyways, I guess I mm. keep on going to our water burger, like mm. I was saying. We love because it. Because all their stuff there is very fresh. It's very good. 
They make it quick. Never disappointed. They cook it while you wait. The waiting is not that long because they always have enough employees inside the place and everybody is assigned to a task. While the one that's frying the burger and making the burgers, the other one is in charge mm. of putting all the stuff or not on your bread. The other one wraps up. The other one <coughs> takes the money. The other one bags it. And when you have a lot of people working in an industry that makes billions of dollars a year, yeah, get the people. It's good. You want to go there because you know they're quick, they're accurate, and you get what you want. So with that, guys, I'm going to let you guys go while I start digging into my fries that I haven't had any, that much of them. And I'm going to tell you... Uh, Let's learn how to love each other. Michael, stop. That is so disgusting. It's, it was delicious. I don't know why he does that. I know it was. And um, let's try not to fight. Mm -mm. Let's try to love each other. That's right. And care about each other. Yes. And uh, and I guess that's about it, guys. You know? And um, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to uh, press the notification button. So every time you see a, a video like this, sorry, I'm just looking at this guy that's coming towards my car. Uh, you can be notified oh, of the videos too? that we're making. So with that, guys, love you all. Don't forget to subscribe to Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. What else, Michael? We are Tumblr, Pinterest, Pinterest. Patreon. Mm -hmm. And YouTube is dope. Yeah. And if you want to donate a dollar click to, down below uh, to think, just click down below to patreon.com it will take you directly to the site where you can donate from a dollar all the way up so love you all don't drink and drive and have a great what is today thursday january 2nd 2020